שלום, מה שלומך? מה שלומך? Good to have you back. Let us continue with how to parse a verb. We are going to continue exactly where we stopped last time. We are still with the prefixed forms. You remember we were using those letters, this acronym, in English Ethan, in Hebrew Eitan, to remember the pronouns. Aleph is first person common singular. Yod for both third singular, third plural. Tav for all the second persons. And Nun for first person common plural. So what we will do? We will take the Vaiktol and erase this Va. We'll get our new form, which is called Diktol. See, we took out the Va, we get by morphology, Iktol. The translation is not going to be the same, but the form will look like that. I'll read you. No, no, why should I? Let us read together. Let us read from Zechariah 1.16. So, I'm waiting for you. Let's read together. Lachen ko amar Hashem, or Adonai. Shavti li Rushalayim berahamim. Beiti ibaneba inate al Yerushalayim. And the translation, therefore, thus says the Lord. I am returned to Jerusalem with mercies. My house shall be built in it, and a line shall be stretched. So you can already see the translation, but let's go see back where are our, our, our forms, our iktol. So we want to see something similar to vaiktol, but without the vav. Let me circle it for you here, or just draw this box to show it to you. So you see that's Iktol. That's another Iktol. What person? Let us remember what the Yod signifies. Oops, yes, third person, this time singular. So how we are going to translate it all together? See, it's very much different from the Vaiktol. Iktol would be future tense. It would be conditional sometimes, the language of the law, like we had now. So, no wonder why we had the shell. Sometimes general truth, habitual present, past iterative, which means a, an habitual action in the past. So, somebody that used to do something in the past. Now, let's do an exercise like that. I'll show you a verse. Let's see if you can find the actor. Okay? Oh, I know it's easy. <laughs> so let's read it first because it's so beautiful. So, Mizmor le David. Adonai ro'i lo ehsar. A psalm of David. The Lord is my shepherd. I lack nothing. Okay, you can clearly see from the English we, hear, we have the first person common singular. Now, just let's find it. In the Hebrew, so I'm looking for an Aleph. I'm looking for an Aleph prefix. It must appear at the beginning, no Vav before it. Yes, that is the one. I lack. That's the negative. So if you wish to have it as a banner, why don't you write us? And we will make sure to send you one. And אני מחכה לכם. Right, I'm waiting for you. אז תודה להתראות.